Yeah. So we're here at the Ghost in the Shell event. I'm with my boy Seb. Yay. What up? I'm with my girl Aki. Hi. Everyone's here. And Kizashi. Kizashi. <laughs> I thought you were about to say I'm with my girl Seb. <laughs> and here we are at the Ghost in the Shell event. So we got here a little bit early because uh, we got that press. And uh, yeah, we're going to go check out some of the things that are in here before the whole crowd starts to move in. Let's do it. So we got this dope ass green screen room where you jump in and you can uh, jump into the world of Ghost in the Shell. So uh, let's do it. So I just did that and uh, we get the actual like footage sent to us via email. So you guys are going to see what it looks like right now. Here it is. I don't know if that was cool or not because I haven't seen it yet, but I trust it's cool. Yeah. He's vlogging. I'm vlogging. <laughs> Shh, I'm here. He's vlogging it's right now. Turn. It's my turn. <laughs> so, hey, it's I'm here with Maud Garrett, Maud Garrett from SourceFed. Hey, what's so, up? We ran into each other. Yeah, um, I mean, the I'm so happy because I finally Aussie. got to meet a fellow Australian. Yeah. A few I mean, of us here, not many, few and far between. Yeah. But usually you just look out for the tall people. <laughs> <laughs> it's always the, the tall chicks are always the Australians. I'm nearly six feet tall. Yeah, you are taller than me. I'm taller than you. That is. Uh, and I'm wearing flats. You're taller That's than like, most. I'm yeah. taller than most people. Yeah, you're gonna look at this vlog and it's gonna be like down here. Yeah, you must. <laughs> you must really have some trouble in Japan, don't you? Good chin shot. This is my first time. This is my first time in Japan. Oh, first time. Yeah. No, yeah. Are you, are you uh, Japan skid S. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Yeah. I just said I like Japan. Do you know any more Japanese? Uh, hi. <laughs> oh, there you go. Uh, there you go. Genki des? Genki des? Yeah. Because I messed up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Matt Pat's like really getting the basics down. Yeah, he's really helping <laughs> out in the sidelines. Oh, there you go. So, I uh, hope you enjoy the event. Yeah, thanks sir. Are you, um, do you vlogging. like Ghost in the Shell? You know what, I'm actually coming at this from a very different angle, which is uh, I'm not too fluent in anime at all, mm -hmm. but I am excited to see how someone who doesn't know the anime world, uh, right. world well interprets this and right. sees if it's right. something that we would enjoy. Awesome. Yeah, perspective. There you go, that's important. So Yay. look forward to that. My turn. Yay. Yay! Oh my god. Yay. I can't fucking believe I'm meeting Matt Pat right now. That is, I don't know, man. It's insane. It's awesome to meet you, it's man. It's insane to just like finally get to see someone you've been watching for years. Thank and you. I don't know, man. Like, yeah, you're gonna see this camera. It's like, <laughs> dude, that's what it would have been like. Like, if I didn't get you vlogging, that would have been my footage. It's just all been like, just shaking the whole time. I can't believe him. <laughs> well, that's really flattering. Yeah, yeah. I appreciate it. Um, so you're here for film theory. I am. Right? Yes. Uh huh. So uh, how actually, are you? Actually, actually, it was a terrible decision. They brought me here for game theory, which made no sense. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, why? But okay, sure. Have you, have you, have you played, played the Ghost in the Shell game? No, actually, I the, haven't. There's the uh, FPS game. Really? Yeah, yeah, I've never actually played it. I heard it's not, not great, but... Really? Okay. Yeah, but I, I don't know. Like, you can do it for game theory? Sure. I mean, but... At, at this day and age, like, any... Pretty much any movie you can, like, cross over and something Pretty much. But I... Yeah, I'm here for film theory. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. So that's going to be really awesome to see. Yeah! Um, I'm excited about it. Like... But we'll, we'll see what ends up happening. We'll see. I pitched them a lot of ideas that I was really stoked about. They're right. still, I guess, mulling it over. I don't know. Awesome. So we'll, we'll find there you out. go. I'm just fucking stoked to finally meet right? you, man. This I is just, awesome, I just man. Like, oh, thank you. Any, <laughs> any suggestions for uh, future episodes that you want to see? Dude, I'm, I love everything you made. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. I mean, I'll, I might suggest something, but I don't know if it'll be up to your standards. Ooh, or okay. We'll see. Okay. Off camera. Off camera. That's, that that's that way, that way, if it isn't up to my standards, I can like rate him. <laughs> Fuck like, you. Yeah, I'd be like, how dare you approach me with such a suggestion? Big con. There you go. Check out MatPat, guys. Links oh, will be you. in the description. Although I don't know if it'll be much help considering you're like 20 times my size. No, but... it would be, it would, it would be a huge help. Thank you. <laughs> awesome. well, there you go. Well, you'll hit a million soon. Yeah, I'm, I'm almost at a million. Right? Oh man, golden play button. Dude, I'm pumped. You're almost at a million, which means the golden play button will be coming a year yeah. later. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
Really the first thing that we wanted to do when we, when we launched the film was to come to the birthplace of the film to show both the creators, the people who um, really started the whole thing going, that we were taking this next chapter of the legacy very seriously and that it wasn't going to be something they'd be uh, upset about, they'd be very proud of. So it was important for us to come here and say this is what we've done, this is what we're doing. We're not remaking, we're reimagining, but we're reimagining with you, alongside you. And it's, uh, it's a great honor and privilege to work with, with some of these people. From uh, Shiro's manga to Oshi's anime to Kamiyama's standalone complex, I didn't really have to do anything. I just stole from all of them and put it together and <laughs> off we go. So my job was very easy. Now, in seriousness, it's been a to draw on something as seminal as that. You know, I was a fan growing up, so um, to me it was an honor to take that stuff. And, and, you know, I tried to, my litmus test was, do I like what I'm doing? You know, my gut check, and if I was kind of inspired by it, then it, it, it kind of stayed in the film. <laughs> これ were you aware of uh, Ghost in the Shell uh, prior to uh, being cast? No, I actually I didn't know the material and uh, I when the script came to me um, it also came with a copy of the anime, and uh, you know, when I first saw it, I it seemed quite daunting. Um, I think because you know the, the anime is so philosophical, and I didn't know how it would exactly translate to a live action film, or really what I could contribute to it exactly. Mm -hmm. um, but it was alluring. I started to imagine that this was a character who was really living, who was really living a very unique experience of somebody who has an idea of who she thinks she was, and then who she is now, the life she's living now, and then this, then the person that she feels she is, this sort of gnawing, clawing feeling she has in her, in her ghost, um, and the, that. Being able to kind of play these three sides, you know, we called it the sort of the ego and the super ego and the right. id, yeah. and um, that that was really that was pretty enticing for me. Right. My hope for the fans is that they get taken on a ride that is not just explosive and exciting, but also you know allows them to be reflective and 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 um, and to be you know, curious, more curious about themselves uh, from watching this film, so I, I hope it resonates that, that deeply with them. Sanders! Yo, we just got free Posters we got bling. We got bling. We got bling. We got bling. Yeah, very we nice. got bling. <laughs> so, uh, how did we all think of the presentation? Yeah, it was super fun. Did you have fun? Yeah, I I'm like actually it. really, really looking forward to this movie. Yeah, <laughs> dude, those, yeah. like we can't share the clips, but yeah, we, we, from what we saw, yeah. it's pretty badass. Yeah, yeah. Scarlet looks hot. Scarlet looks hot.
Scarlett. Yeah, so anyone that is like totally against Scarlett being major, dude, no, fuck that. Yeah, she's fuck awesome. That shit. Dude, yeah. she is perfect for the role. Like, what we, what, seriously. What we saw, I yeah. wouldn't have picked anyone better yeah. than Scarlett. We are eyewitness. Like, we saw her live and we saw the trailer. We were the first people in the world to see the trailer, and we can tell you guys firsthand that the movie's gonna be fucking awesome. So I'm super pumped for that. Um, but yeah, I think uh, that's the end of our night for now. I'm hungry. I am hungry, so we're gonna go. We're gonna go eat. But guys, uh, it was a super fucking awesome event. Uh, I got to meet so many cool people um, and just got to see so many like awesome people. I mean, I saw like fucking like Hideo Kojima. He was in there. And I walked right past him, but I couldn't go near him you because I was like, me at first. "Yeah, I was like, no, that must be a lookalike." But then I checked on his Twitter, and sure enough, he was right there. And like other big names, like Momo Ikari was there. Mamoru Oshii, the director of the original anime, was in that room. There was just a lot of famous people just in that room, and I was just so fucking pumped. Um, so yeah, guys, it was a super awesome event. Thank you uh, for to Breaker for taking us here and. Uh, I'm so fucking looking forward to the movie and I hope you guys are too. Anyways guys, thanks for watching. As always like your favorite if you enjoy. Subscribe for more Anna. Keep watching anime. Ciao!